Queen Elizabeth II sent a six-page letter to royal interior designer Pamela Hicks after the death of the her beloved Corgi. Ms. Hicks claimed that she sometimes writes to the Queen to tell her things of supposed interest. She said, the only time she has ever replied was when I sent my sympathy after one of her dogs had been killed by a Clarence House Corgi. She then wrote six pages. Newspaper diarist Kenneth Rose kept private journals during his career. The royal biographer mixed within royal circles and had several conservations with palace staff during his career. The Daily Mail has reported on excerpts from the diaries. The excerpts reveal the Queen wrote the six-page letter on the death of a beloved corgi during the mid-1990s. Revealing the monarch's love for her animals, on June 3, 1995 Mr. Rose wrote, I stay for the weekend with interior decorator David and Pamela Hicks. And on March 21, 1997 Mr. Rose wrote, Prince Charles tells me that the head of Wimbledon asked whether he thought the Queen would come to open a new court. I doubt it, Prince Philip replied, unless there are dogs and horses. Mr. Kenneth Vivian Rose was educated at Repton and New College, Oxford. He served in the Welsh Guards 1943-6 and was attached to Phantom, 1945. Phantom, also known as GHQ Liaison Regiment, was a special reconnaissance unit first formed in 1939 during the early stages of World War II. The regiment's headquarters were at the Richmond Hill Hotel in Richmond, Surrey. Its space was at Pembroke Lodge, a Georgian house in Richmond Park, London. Mr. Rose did a brief spell of teaching as an assistant master at Eton College, 1948. His journalistic career began when he joined the editorial staff of the Daily Telegraph, a position he held from 1952 to 1960. Rose was an award-winning writer, having won the prestigious Whitbread Book Award in the biography category in 1983 for his book, King George V. He was appointed CBE in the 1997 New Year Honours. In April 2005, days before the wedding of Prince Charles and Camilla Parker Bowles, a British tabloid published that the couple were related, as ninth cousins, by way of the second Duke of Newcastle upon Tyne. Rose said that, although the apparent familiarity between the two was not well established, a family connection was perfectly factable. Queen Elizabeth II's corgis were the Pembroke Welsh corgi dogs owned by Queen Elizabeth II and her parents, King George VI and Queen Elizabeth the Queen Mother. Fond of corgis since she was a small child, Elizabeth II has owned more than 30 corgis since she became Queen of the Commonwealth Realms in 1952. Queen Elizabeth II has owned at least one corgi at any given time between the years 1933 to 2018.